books and sleep and sir i am also indebted to you sir for your guidance motivation and your time to time motivation video sir and more than uh, suppose i read the chapters then i used to watch the videos so i bring in all the wishes and greetings and behalf of all the faculty members of speed medical institute to dr kunal thakur for scoring rank number 26 in hmch adenac oncology congratulations to you doctor thank you so much sir thank you so much sir so great your wonderful and great achievement and uh, and also to great to have you in the session today and can we know your detailed background of where you started and what all you did till date so sir i started my journey from uh, 2011 when i joined mbbs i did my mbbs in uh, from uh, sikkim manipal institute of medical sciences kangtok and uh, completed in 2017 with internship 2018 i joined my uh, uh, pg course msnt in shri deerajers medical college kolar and thereafter i worked as one year in uh, senior residentship and then one year in uh, assistant professor there itself thereafter i took a break for some time and recently i have joined uh, b borwa cancer institute as a fellow head and neck fellow so currently i was working while uh, preparing for the exams as well sir very good doctor very detailed <laughs> accomplishment Thank history you. and very good and uh, the idea to do a superficiality when it came and why do you want to do a head and neck oncology any specific reason so who inspired you something that way <laughs> so the uh, greatest source of uh, inspiration came from my father sir who is himself a head and uh, ent surgeon sir okay. professor and ent sir and so then uh, i did my pg from uh, shri deerajers medical college there my faculty they were all uh, inclined towards head and neck we had exposure there so i developed interest from the first year itself so i thought of giving it a try sir and uh, and when i joined the fellowship here so again that interest Uh, gave way to this preparation, sir. So once you decided to go for a superficiality, from that date till date, what all you have undergone to accomplish this, and what is your preparation strategy? Yes, sir. So, sir, uh, I ensured that I should read sir, at least uh, two to three hours per day. Some days were like at, uh, duties were hectic, so I could manage only one or two hours. But those days also, at least I I would finish some topics and sleep. and uh, i enjoyed watching sir's uh, teja sir's videos and more than uh, suppose i read the chapters then i used to watch the videos so i used to like read and then watch the videos so that helped me in uh, revising the same topic in a short time sir very good very good so now and then yes sir and yeah, please, then please. Lately, sir i used to give the the grand tests and as you had suggested to give grand tests and the uh, time allotted time bound tests which was a recent pattern so actually that helped sir because to manage the time and to take off the pressure during the exam real exam right so number of questions you answered so i answered 149 sir okay one question i could not answer because it was like not uh, selected from uh, uh, this things it went like that only it went waste <laughs> <laughs> okay so now in your preparation during your preparation you would have felt i need to tell someone when they are preparing to do and not to do uh, yes yeah, something that way can you let us know <laughs> yes sir. so uh, sometimes while reading we feel this way ki okay fine i have read this chapter i have understood this concept so if at all i get a chance to tell people i will tell them ki what all to pay emphasis on and then to pay emphasis more on clinical aspects and the same way we were being taught in the speed app that to pay attention on clinical aspects mostly not not on theories more but clinical aspects clinical based questions are the key sir nowadays i feel okay so what will be your advice for the future aspirants and and also time to thank and whom all you feel like thanking to help you from day one till date you can do so so as advice will be sir simple only that to keep on working hard and the material provided is awesome sir it's uh, there is no uh, second thought to it so i think if someone just follows the material and give the tests on time so that can be done sir and we should not get disheartened if suppose the scores are low initially but eventually we'll pick up on that sir and sir to thank uh, i'd like to definitely thank first the almighty to have blessed me to help me perform on the day and so my parents and then my well wisher sir the colleagues my faculties all the ugs pg and the 
recent faculty sir so i am and sir i am also in debt to you sir for your guidance motivation and your time to time motivation video sir and sir <laughs> teja sir for his uh, awesome uh, video sir and material sir very good doctor and as team uh, speed team sir for the overall help sir great so once again wish you all the best and all the success for a great career ahead in mchrn oncology best wishes to you thank you sir thank you, thank you.